Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss the page level filter in Power BI. So I've uploaded this file called add a page level filter Power BI on GitHub and I will leave a link to this uh, file on the video notes so you can grab the file and do the tutorial along with me. I've got this Power BI file open here with me and I've got two um, visuals. So let me just select one and if I scroll on this visual to the bottom, it gives me, it shows me the option of page level filters. And what I can do is I can, let's just select English country region name and use it as a page level filter. And I will just use basic filters. It gives me an option of basic and advanced. We'll just use basic. And let's say if I select just Australia, what happens? And you can see it shows me um, Australia on the map with the sales amount for Australia. And uh, this, the corresponding sales amount have gone down here. This will become clearer if I select Canada. You will notice that the sales amount go up. And it shows me two places on the map. And similarly, let me select the third one. And you can see that for both the visuals, the, the amounts are changing and things are moving. So these are basically uh, page level filters which impact all the visual. And you can see that uh, as I change the filters, the amounts change and the map shows me different values. For example, I could select Germany as well and United States and United Kingdom. And the amounts change on the map also becomes an interactive map showing me amounts in different parts of the map. So that's how a typical page level filter works, that it impacts all the visuals on a particular page. I hope you find this video useful and uh, in terms of your understanding of page level filters. I hope you enjoy the video. Please do subscribe to my channel if you enjoy what I'm doing. Thanks again. Bye.